Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to Omni's Eat. I'm Jessica, and I'm going to do a full day of eating with you today. Um, it is about 9.15. I actually had a dentist appointment this morning to get a tooth checked out. Um, everything looks like it's going to be okay, but I do have to have another procedure on it, which kind of stinks, but that's for a later date. Today, we are going to be eating, um, and I'm going to be sharing it with you. <laughs> Because, you know, that's what I do. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and turn the camera around and show you what I'm having for breakfast. So I am already sitting at my work desk. And this is going to be my breakfast today. Normally I only eat like the bar or eggs and yogurt or something like that. But I'm mixing it up. And I'm going to have a Quest Hero Bar. This is the oh, old packaging. But uh, still the same bar. This is the chocolate caramel pecan flavor of the Quest Hero Bar. Which I do really enjoy those. And then I'm having two hard boiled eggs with some uh, Himalayan pink salt sprinkled on top. So this is going to be my breakfast today. This is about 340 calories. Four net carbs. Because the bar is four net carbs. The eggs have zero net carbs. Or, or basically zero carbs. So um, I think eggs technically have like a trace carb in them. But this is going to be my breakfast. A Quest Hero Bar and two hard boiled eggs. I do know what I'm going to have for lunch. Uh, I'm actually repeating my lunch that I had yesterday, so I'll show you that when we get there. I'm not 100% sure what I'm having for dinner, though. I'm not sure. So, I am going to go ahead and eat this. I am kind of hungry, and I want to get started with my breakfast and get started with my work day. I'm starting a little bit late today because of that dentist appointment, but I'm going to go ahead and eat my breakfast, and when it's time for lunch, I will show you what I'm making. All right, you guys, it is time for lunch, and I'm kind of hungry. It's not too late. It's about 12.40 right now, so I'm going to throw my lunch together and eat it. Um, yeah. All right, I'm going to go ahead and turn the camera around and show you what I'm making. All right, so here is what I'm making for lunch. I have it all set, up, set out here, but I'm going to be using two slices of this um, Lovin' Fresh bread uh, from Aldi's. This is the zero net carb, and this is the wheat version. So I'm going to have two slices of this. I'm going to put a little bit of butter on it to, you know, make my grilled cheese and chicken. This is boar's head ever roast chicken, just deli meat. This is boar's head mild provolone. So I'm going to use, actually probably use all of what I have left. I'm going to weigh it out and put it in my um, fitness pal. But I'm probably just going to use all of this just to make my sandwich. It's going to probably be a pretty thick sandwich, but that's okay. And then I have about a half a bag of this American blend salad mix I'm going to have. I have some of this Mexican style cheese. Uh, some Olive Garden dressing and then I drank about half of this Pepsi Zero earlier today. I'm going to finish that. So I'm going to put together my salad, put together my grilled chicken and cheese sandwich. It's probably going to take me about 15 minutes or so to get it all ready to go, but that is going to be my lunch today. I will show you what it looks like when it is ready to eat and I'm sure it's going to be delicious. So I will show you that in just a minute. All right, you guys, so here is my finished lunch. I've got my salad over here. It ended up being about 186 grams, I think, of the salad, and then a serving of the cheese and one serving of the salad dressing, that's what's in here. I did put some Duke's mayonnaise actually in my sandwich. Let me show you. If you guys can see there on each side of the bread, um, there is a total of one serving in the sandwich um, just across the two slices of bread. And then I had all of the turkey, I'm sorry, the chicken and the cheese in there. So this is going to be my lunch. It's going to be a grilled chicken and cheese sandwich and then my salad. That ended up taking me about 20 minutes to get everything together. The sandwich took a little bit longer, probably because there were so many layers and I didn't put a lid on it. If I would have put a lid on it, the cheese would have melted um, faster, but I didn't put a lid on it. So this is going to be my lunch. It's going to be pretty good. Um, I do like this low carb bread. I have not tested ketones or anything after it for me. Um, I'm just starting to get into taste testing ketones. Um, I know it doesn't affect my blood sugar. In fact, I'm probably going to take my blood sugar today. I left my door open over here, but I am probably going to take my blood sugar today after my lunch. I know that the salad, I know that the, the zero um, sugar soda doesn't affect me. Um, but I do like to test the things that I start to add into my diet as I go. Um, I usually test it a couple times before I believe that like my body is definitely digesting it well. So I'm going to go ahead and test my blood sugar probably today um, after I, I have my lunch. So I'm going to go ahead and eat my lunch and I will see you guys at dinner time. All right, y'all, it is time for dinner. John decided to uh, join me on screen. I am joining you on screen. We already made Nick's dinner. He's having, uh, Nick's having scrambled eggs and, a so and sausage patties. 
pork sausage patties. And then uh, John and I were trying to decide what we were gonna have, and I already know what I'm having. I have it laid out on the, on the uh, stove behind me, and I'm gonna show it to you here in a second. And John's like, I'll have the exact same thing. It's me. So uh, we're gonna make this up, and we're gonna both have this exact same thing. So I'm gonna turn the camera around and show you what it is I'm making. Except that he already had a pickle, because I can smell it on his breath. Two pickles. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go ahead and show you what we're making. Carb bound tortilla. Turkey sausage links. There's six of them in here. We're each gonna have three. I don't know, are you gonna have a taco shell? A tortilla? No, John's not gonna have a tortilla, but I am. I'm gonna have an egg and sausage uh, tortilla. So I'm gonna have a tortilla. I'm gonna have three sausages. John's gonna have three sausages. And then we've got some of these free range eggs. I'm gonna have three. John's gonna have three. And then I'm having a serving of cheese. You want cheese in yours? Sure. So we're gonna have scrambled eggs with a serving of Mexican style cheese. That's the bowl that I used to make Nick's eggs already. And three sausages, except I think I'm gonna cut my sausages up and put it in with my eggs so I can put it in my tortilla. John is probably gonna have them just as separate sausages or something, I don't know. But I'm gonna have a scrambled egg and cheese and sausage tortilla for dinner. So I'm gonna go ahead and cook my dinner up, cook John's dinner up, and then we're gonna have it to eat. So I will show you what it looks like before I dig in. All right, you guys, um, this is gonna be my dinner. I got food all over the stove. I haven't cleaned the stove off yet, so I apologize. But this is gonna be my dinner tonight. John already ate his eggs. I made his eggs first, but I cut up the sausages. They are mixed in with the eggs. I've got the cheese in there as well. So I'm gonna have my egg taco for dinner, and it is gonna be very, very yummy. The only thing I added to my eggs, I did not add heavy whipping cream today. The only thing I added was salt and pepper. So that's all that is in there and then the cheese and sausage. So I'm gonna go ahead and eat my dinner. That is gonna be it for tonight. I'm not gonna eat any dessert tonight, although I really would like to, I'm not going to. Um, I'm gonna be drinking my water with my dinner, which is around here somewhere. I think it's over on the table, but I have water sitting here somewhere that I'm drinking. But I've, I'm kind of off center here because beside my head, I'm gonna be putting my macros for today. Um, I just kind of out of calories today. I don't wanna go much higher on my calories. And I think the rest of my macros are looking not too bad. My uh, fat's definitely too low in my opinion. Um, I should have higher fat, but I'm just higher protein today because I had the uh, lunch meat for lunch and that doesn't have any fat really at all. So um, anyway, you should be seeing my my macros or they should have already come and gone but that is going to be it for my full day of eating today um, I do hope you enjoyed this video if you did a thumbs up is always appreciated if you haven't already if you'd like to subscribe we appreciate that as well and if you have any comments go ahead and leave those in the comment section down below she wants food she wants me to share my dinner with her what what I'm gonna go ahead and leave you with a final shot of my dear puppy dog buttercup here she is Hi, Buttercup, honey. Hi, baby. Who's a good girl? Who's a good girl? Say, pause up for butt for Omni's eat. Yes, pause up for Omni's eat. Help. All right, we'll see you guys on the next Omni's eat. Bye.